Okay guys, I'm back in watering waves. So this is the second part of the video. Uh, it's still lagging, god damn it. Hold on now. Uh. Okay, this is better now. So yeah, on the first video, there were so many problems, but that's caused by full screen. Eh? So now I'm playing on window mode, this should be much smoother. I played a bit on stream just to open up the map a bit. But I haven't continued the story yet. So I opened quite a lot already. <laughs> Not really a lot. But okay, so now I think we're going to chapter 1 and 2. I think. So every time I dash and move, it lags for a while. I did not open this one though. So let's just continue to the second part of the story. God damn it, hold on. This always happens. When I open Wandering Ways, what the hell? Give me a minute. There's some compensation also. Yes, there's two of them. Holy shit, okay. Uh, hold on, this, this is getting annoying. Hold on, this whatever that's coming in my not notification. I need, to, I need to solve that problem first. Stop, what the hell? much better now. Still, uh, how to say? Still not smooth. But I guess I should lower the FPS maybe that uh, I don't really need to play that high. My computer, my laptop's not really that strong. If I play 30, would it be fine? This is fine. I play twenty four on Genshin. Here we are, Jinjo's Nexus Tower. Exactly. Let me see. Uh, think of it as Jinjo's largest service station, or an integration hub. It's something along those lines. I'm not much of a tech person myself. Long story short, it's a navigator, a defense system and a regional information center all in one enormous packet. The smaller ones we ran into earlier are resonance beacons. Data is shared between all beacons. You activate one and the entire map's data will be relayed to your terminal. Pretty nifty. Just place your terminal here. Basically, statue and waypoints are the same, same concept. Surprisingly, I already opened the rest, <laughs> and now only that they're introducing it here. Okay, this isn't my first uh, whatever this thing is called again. Okay, so now I can see this area. But yeah, I already opened this and this. <laughs> Just yesterday. Okay, wow, Jinso is quite big. Compared to the others that I opened. Take the elevator to reach the city. I have the arrangements in place. Over. You can come visit the magistrate at any time, Shizia. 
Do you mind bringing Rover over to the city hall? Oh, so Yan Yan actually isn't with us. Just me and she's yeah. Wait, can I? Ah, L. Okay, so these are team comms. Okay. Yeah, so I only have three at the moment. Okay. Uh, just in case anything, might as well level up everyone. Two each, maybe? Just make it close to 20. Because why not? And also the rover. There. Okay. Think you can catch up? <laughs> I like when you're running fast, you're still gaining energy. <laughs> Only dashing consumes energy. That makes traveling more only. such a crowd in front of the city hall. I was surprised too. I've never seen so many non-staff personnel here before. Most of the people here have applied for an audience, but I heard they've all been turned down. Turned down? It's Michelle I think. There is a small chance she's not in the city hall, but it's very unlikely for her not to be in Jinzhou. Or rather, it's nearly impossible for the magistrate to leave Jinzhou at all. With her busy schedule, it's already difficult to find I figured out that every dialogue in addition, is uh, has the magistrate different. Jin Zhou, it's not all the leaving same. Leaving the land under her jurisdiction without authentication is not allowed. Unless she's engaged on a business trip or when Jinzhou's safety is under threat. Yep, yeah, there's gotta be something big if that's the case. People were advised to leave oh, by the magistrates bodyguard the upon sending in their <laughs> applications. The ones staying here are either trying to apply for the few that Oops. made it inside. Set. It, it only took one freezing look from Lady Sunwa, and they were compelled to leave. What kind of description is that? Sounds like they've met some snake-haired lady and got turned into uh, stone. Sunwa. She's the magistrate's personal bodyguard. Oh, I've yeah, heard of her before. Right. She's the all-round death glare slash terminator ice beauty. That's what the rumors say, at least. Okay, so we have to say this then. So this is the true confidence of our rover. I agree, though. So far, you've been ticking all the boxes in our magistrate's description. Sure it can. Have you thought of something, Rover? Uh, I mean, what do I I can't really keep up with your thoughts, but I think a meeting with a magistrate wouldn't hurt. Same here. Anyway, our magistrate's the best lead we have for now, no matter what she has in store for Rover. What do you think? Huh? Me? I'm just wondering how to take you, Yang Yang, and Baijiu for some chow after this. But my shift's almost coming up. Don't know if we'll make it. I don't have anything particular in mind. It was me who... Uh, I mean, we took you to Jinzhou. I think we should keep you company. At least while you're still here. Oh, I see. What do you think, Rover? Are you in a hurry to recover your memories? Mm. 
doesn't bother or suddenly Damn <laughs> Well, you really want to know, yes, huh? most certainly. In that case, how about meeting with the magistrate first? She may have the answers you're looking for. We're not allowed to go with you. Shizzy and I will be right outside the city hall. We'll be waiting for you. That's right. We're not going anywhere. Just give us a shout if anything goes down. <gasps> Wait, no, we won't be able to hear you. Plus, they've got this rule about not yelling inside the city hall. <laughs> what is he? Yeah, are you serious? Okay, then the Rover. Just the the place the Rover for now. Head to the city hall. I think in this video I'll just cover Act 2, but I don't know how long will it be. I'm guessing it won't be reaching an hour if I don't take too much time, maybe. <laughs> Ooh. Switch to walking, is it the same like Genshin? No, I don't I don't know, I don't think so. <laughs> or oh, is it control? No, I don't think so. Kindly have a seat. I just sit down right here. Alright then. Lady Sanwa will be with you shortly. I'm not even sitting down. <laughs> okay, there we go. That sound Oh. your acquaintance. I apologize for the delay. My name is San Hua, the bodyguard of Madam Magistrate. I regret to inform you that Madam Magistrate is currently away. So she is Prior away. to her departure, she instructed me to bring you these tokens and a welcome gift. So it is Ansla. Oh, uh, <laughs> that, that confirms it. Magistrate advise you to explore what these tokens represent during her absence. This mm. may help you acquire the information you desire sooner. I apologize for the inconvenience, but please rest assured she will be here to meet you in three days' time. Uh, where is the Magistrate? Why three days? How am I supposed to know what the tokens represent? I want to ask all three of these. Uh, I'll ask this first. Sorry, I cannot disclose her whereabouts at this time. Please trust me that she is eagerly looking forward to meeting you in person. Pardon my inability to provide a better answer. Not a magistrate has a task that she must handle alone. But she has never for one moment forgotten about her meeting with you. Not knowing exactly when you'd arrive, she had to leave without having the chance to welcome you in person. Why three days? Because she will require at least three days to complete her current task. Madam Magistrate wanted to assure you that in three days, by any means, she will return to meet you in person. You... I'll be sure to convey your kindness to Madam Magistrate. Please accept my sincerest gratitude. Yes, Madam Magistrate does hope to have your assistance, but there is no rush for a decision. She does not want to pressure you into anything you may not desire. 
We invite you to learn about our situation before making a final commitment. How do I scroll <laughs> the dialogue? Because the text is longer than it is. Yeah, how am I supposed to know what it is? When it comes to these tokens, it is never her intention to confuse you with the puzzles. Instead, they should serve as clues that lead you toward the truth. Madam Magistrate deeply regrets not having the time to deliver her messages to you in person. We value your presence far more than you might imagine. The same goes for any and all information about you. Okay. Yeah, how certain? Since Madam Magistrate is currently away, I cannot make the final confirmation on her behalf. But you... You are truly exceptional. Mm. Regarding that... Is it this now, then? My mm. eyes can see the frequencies of all living beings. Or rather, those frequencies are the only thing I can see. Oh. You, you share the same frequency with Madam Magistrate. The same frequency? Apologies, my description was not accurate. Both you and Madam Magistrate look undistorted to me. In my eyes, you appear the way you are. So, if NPC... <laughs> I just look like NPCs. <laughs> they all look different. You can tell someone doesn't want to talk. Okay, sure. Terminal for a moment? Uh, my terminal? Yes, it's the gourd on your waist. The device every resonator carries. Madam Magistrate, I know what it is. Might need it. But okay. The utility module on your terminal has been upgraded to the latest iteration. Now, all the utilities, including sensor, levitator, and grapple, should be fully functional. You are now granted unlimited access to all regions in Jinjo. I have sent your terminal ID to every border pass and residence beacon. You will only need to display your terminal ID or activate a beacon with your terminal for entry. You are free to visit okay, any still, part of Jinjo. I don't know how to scroll that. <laughs> all the into city also no more not. <laughs> yes, including the city hall. You have full access to its facilities. Well, I was already able to activate all the terminals before this happened. <laughs> also, may I ask, have you decided your place of residence in Jinjo? If not, Madam Magistrate has arranged accommodation for you in advance, here in the City Hall. Oh man, I have no idea what to say. These two are not the same, these two are not the same. Uh, I'll just here, I come. That won't be necessary. Um, okay, fine. I'll just take the first option. I'll lead you to your room if you need. Ah, uh, that won't be necessary. I'll place you outside. This one, okay. Understood. We will be ready to accommodate you anytime. Okay. We got one last first time, I saw that. Inquire? Anything I can help you with, Grover? Jinzo, okay, let's ask some questions. What do you wish to know about Jinjo? The Midnight Rangers, under General Jian's command, are a garrison in Jinjo. They consist of the vanguards for offensive operations against tacit discords. Hey, Additionally, okay. there is a detachment unit okay. called the Outriders. Outriders. The volunteers or reservists, okay. whose most of the servicemen of today are comprised of resonators. With pleasure. What do you wish to know about Jin Jinjo? Is not the most populated city in Huanlong. As a border city, it is the front line encountering tacit dis. Mm -hmm. Jinjo holds a special place in my heart. I can't say I am too familiar with my hometown. But I do feel a homely sense of attachment to Jinjo. Okay. 
If I were to introduce Jinjo, with pleasure. What do you wish to anything I can help you with, Rover? Magistrate, the doctor has a problem. You know, okay, let's ask him. Of course. <laughs> Please feel free to ask me anything. Our magistrate's birth name was C. C. She took on the name Jin C when she ah, became Jin the magistrate okay, of Jinjo. Nowadays, she is usually addressed as Madam Magistrate. Of course. Please feel free to ask Jin me C anything. And, and I will let you. She is also known as the Loom Maiden because Jabin? of her residence connection with our sentinel, Jue, who manifests in the shape of a loom. Like the dragon we saw? The loom? <laughs> the ways the loom. where Long's magistrates interact with their corresponding sentinels can differ. In Jinjo, our magic okay. this is what I understand from what she has told me. Of course. Please feel free to... It depends on the Madam Magistrate. And it depends on your decision, Rover. Please pardon me. Our decision? This is all I can say at the moment. Of course. Please feel free to ask me anything. Anything I can help you with, Rover? With pleasure. What do you wish to know how about can, the yeah, tokens? How can I, make use? I suggest looking into where these tokens come from, examine their locations of origin, and explore the sites or past events they represent. With pleasure. What do you wish to know can I about not the tokens? Investigate? Um. Of course, it is fully up to you. With pleasure. Okay, Anything we can I can even help you not with? do that. Of course. Please feel free to ask me anything, and I will answer to the best of my ability. Have we met before? I'm afraid not. No. I have never seen you before. If I had, I would never forget you. Anything I can help you with, Rover? Are you saying she looks so familiar? Nah, that's someone else, right? Okay, interesting. Jinsi's token. Alright. So, let's talk to them again. Wait, uh. Yeah, I just realized we still cannot do any wish yet, or whatever you call it here. I think I have to finish a bit more to unlock. Oh, really, twenty minutes. Yeah, so far, this is much smoother than <laughs> yesterday. <laughs> And it's always stuck at 65. It's like 65 is the percentage that's stuck every time. Okay, so far, well, story wise, it sounds a little complicated. And like so sudden. <laughs> okay, we're back with these two again. It took you so long. What gives? Was our magistrate a chatterbox? No, uh, it was, was even. It wasn't even uh, the magistrate. So, not a magistrate's not in the city hall. Hmm. You were right, then. Quite a long place. <laughs> it sure is. Shusia, the increasing tacit fields, uncannily powerful tacit discords, and now. Our magistrate's absence, plus the mysterious rover, I'm afraid. What should we get for dinner? There's no need to worry, to so much Well, we've reported to the City Hall, the Ministry of War, and the Academy. We've done everything we can. I mean, this is one long, and we're talking about Jin Zhou of all places. We've been through our fair share of unrest over the past thousand years. And we've made it together every time. There's been TD outbreaks every year. 
But we can always trust General Ji Yan, Madam Magistrate, and our Sentinel to have our backs. We're not ones to mess with. United we stand, a bastion of might. One equals a legion, invulnerable in fight. Well said, Chizya. Do you have any plans, Rover? It's a three day vacation in my books. <laughs> Fair point? A three-day vacation it is. Let's go chill out then. We'll figure out the tokens when we have the chance. <gasps> Ooh, reminds me of the tokens of love in those stories. It sounds like you're off to a secret date or something. What is our magistrate planning to do with these token puzzles? Over. Do you mind if we have a look at the tokens? Does these two know anything? So? What's so special about them? Take the candy, take the small device, take the leaf, take the black fruit. Huh? Okay, it, it was it was all this random stuff, but that's all. I mean, I uh, are we investigating one by one? Okay, let's let's just, just take the candy. A candy. Oh, yeah, I've had these yeah. when I was a kid. Investigating one I think by one. they were called sugar pearls, but I haven't seen anything like this in a while. Went out of trend, maybe. It reminds me of my childhood. I still remember the taste. It was so sweet. I was really scared of getting my flu shots when I was little. And sometimes the nurse lady would hand out candies like this as a prize for being good. But what does it mean as a token? A small device. Hmm. Just it like a pin. seems like a miniature sundial. Sundial? It is a horological device that tells time oh. by using sunlight's direction. Sundials in Huanlong usually have marked lines for the 12 shuchans in a day. And every shuchan is two hours long, with some showing seasons or months. The design of this sundial looks a bit unusual, though. On this sundial, Time seems to be represented by the twelve earthly branches drawn on the outer ring of its surface. And its inner ring shows the four symbols, each representing one cardinal direction. These are the four famous auspicious beasts in Huang Long's folklore. They are believed to protect people from all four directions and generally. The teal long represents the east. The white tiger stands for the west. The vermilion bird stands for the south. And finally, this reminds me of the we four have the black tortoise well for the familiar. north. It seems the sundial is supposed to show both time and direction. But how can it work when there is not a compass attached? Not to mention, the lack of sunlight basically renders it useless. Ugh, that requires way too much brain power. The leaf? The color of this leaf seems a bit odd. Can't tell what tree it is. I think I can feel something from it. Hmm. Never mind. It's too faint. Maybe it was just my imagination. Sorry. I can't tell what kind of tree this leaf belongs to either. The black fruit? This is. Mangosteen? Yep, it is a mangosteen. The are not native to Zhenzhou. Imported by boat. Mm -hmm. I think they're not always available for purchase, though. The frequent tacit Discord outbreaks can disrupt transportation and cause shortages. So Jizya and I share similar childhood memories of the sugar pearl. Do you remember it too, Rover? Memories of the sugar pearl. When it comes to candies. No one knows them better than the kids of Jinjo. Let's go ask around. We should go find buy some shoes. Sure. Which is suitable place to start for? Wait, how? I'm supposed to ask around, but that's optional. 
what is this uh, reach a suitable place to use craft? This? There's still some distance to the Huashu Academy. Let's see who reaches there faster. Yang Yang just installed some apps for you, remember? Just look for the one that's called Utilities on the terminal. New function utility. Okay. Press T for grapple. Oh T, okay. Oh and then T again. See? Just open the utilities. It's literally so like the grapple. Uh, and there you go. If you wanna be a hero like the Jinjo speedster, you gotta master the grapple. Come on, give it a literally. shot. Literally What's this the uh, oh yeah, the the Sumeru one, whatever you call it. So we totally skip the talking to the kids stuff. Yeah, we don't need to even do that. All right. Is that? I just see a. It's a lock. It's a little challenge. Okay, let's do this. Without climbing, can I dash? I mean, can I run? Oh, wait, I can't. How the? Wait, can I use the thing? Is that. If I press T. Never mind. It's not even done. How. Oh, I assume you have to use the. I kinda wanna try this bit. How the There's a long cooldown for the over dashing it. Oh that there, there's these things? Wait, where where are those things? Okay. Oh this Ah Okay, wait. There's this as well. Ah! Okay. But what do I do for him? Is there anything else? Oh, I see. It's right there. Wait. What did I dash here? Oh, 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 okay, 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 like that. God damn it, I nearly made it. Is there another dash thingy? Wait, where do I go from here? Oh, there's another jumping thing. Okay, this is one has no time. Oh, where? oh, I see, okay. There we go. Alright, just uh <laughs> just one challenge. Alright. Oh, wait a sec, someone's looking for me. Yeah? What? When did he disappear? Duty calls. Oops, almost forgot. Can't be late. Sorry, Rover Yin Yang. I've got to head off for my shift. Uh, I'll join you right after I'm done, alright? If you need me, just shout my name. And I, the Jinjo Speedster, will be there in a sec. Myself, uh, what? Well, you only need to send me a terminal message as you shout. Then I'll be there in a jiffy. Anyway, I gotta go. You got sure. Go do your thing. Don't worry. I'm staying with him. I don't even see the two of them. <laughs> Let's go inside. Alright. But we still we still able to play them. <laughs> okay, sure. Why did I miss it? She's probably busy in her lab. Over there must be Mr. Mortify from the Department Mr. of Safety. Mortify. Baiju once mentioned him before. He might be able to help us get in touch with Baiju, but um, it seems we've caught him at a bad time. What is he? Anyway, let's go. 
Let's try asking him, shall we? What? You need something? Uh, straight to the point. Mr. Mortify, please pardon our intrusion. So the arrow is progress basically. And we're here to look for the other dialogue options is just extra dialogue. I see. I hope I didn't cause any offense earlier. Really. Not at all. It was us that bothered you. Baja should be in the data analysis room. I'll go tell her you're here. Thank you, sir. Alright. This is Mortify, a renowned figure in the Department of Safety. He was born in the new federation, and he joined the Washu Academy a few years ago. I heard his talent is truly impressive. People say he's a bit scary at first glance, but he's actually quite kind-hearted once you get to know him. Shizia told me he's quite popular with the kids. Children have been pestering him for all kinds of fancy toys, and he's always open to their requests. Mm -hmm. all right. Here you are. The data we collected in the Gorges of Spirits has been submitted for analysis, and we'll have the results today. I have the equipment for your physical examination. I assume by this, like, character you have to go to get, maybe? Any discoveries during our trip to I the I think it's home? just Chisya and Yang Yang, the only two free characters that we get. Right? What do you think, Aju? I have a hypothesis about the sugar pearl, but I need to verify it first. If possible, I recommend conducting non-destructive tests of all these tokens you have. NDT testing. Uh... Data is always straightforward. The first three tokens can be tested at my branch's laboratory. This miniature sundial will require radiographic testing, though. To access the necessary equipment, we'll need to file a request with one of the Tacitite Studies related branches. Tacitite. Indeed. One moment, please. Give me the items to be tested. Anything else you need me to know, you can let me know now. You may retrieve your items in 20 minutes. And the analysis report will be ready five minutes after that. Take a right, and you'll find me in the testing room. Uh, show all the I don't see anything special with these items. Speaking of the sugar pearl, you all remember eating sugar pearls like this when you were a kid? No, I'm from the New Federation. I remember a nurse lady giving me a candy like that. So. Sugar pearls like this were distributed at hospitals. The sugar pearl might be a type of medicine. Miss Baja, as a Huanglong local working at the academy, I suppose you are... I do have my theory as to what it is, but it still needs verification. I wouldn't proclaim any solid answers before confirming the chemical composition of this... Seconded. Let's find out through actual testing. It will take some time before the results are ready. If you have other matters to take care of, you should go ahead. I'll let you know once we have the results. Shall we wait here at the academy, over? Sure you can. But don't forget your physical examination. I'll see you in a while for that. Hmm, okay. Check. I have the equipment ready. I'll need to check your health status and see if there are any unusual fluctuations. Now let's begin, if you're ready. Can I ask about... Oh, okay, you can ask Do you have any questions before we begin? Do I have to do this one? <laughs> what is an echo? Uh, have you ever come across other things as well? Based on the samples collected, the tacit discord you defeated was at least an overlord class. After defeating it, you seemingly absorbed its frequency energy with your bare hands. You have absorbed a very powerful echo with your body. It may seem fine now. Based okay. on all the records I can find, humans need a pangu terminal in order to record or replicate an echo's frequency. That's why I am quite curious how you could do that. Do you have any questions all right, before we begin? Alright, if, if that was just the reason, okay, sure. Can you try to manifest the Crownless's frequency without using your terminal? Try your best. Hmm. Hmm. I am no 
not seeing the Crownless's data in our terminal. So it was indeed absorbed into your body. The Crownless's frequency energy was consumed by your body, leaving no trace behind. But how did you manage to do that? It's as though there's another mechanism within your body capable of absorbing frequency energy. Your test results don't indicate any trauma. So your amnesia may not be linked to traumatic events. As for your ability to absorb echoes, I can't make a connection between that and your amnesia based on the current data. To put it simply, it seems there is another dimension or a creature hiding inside your body. Sounds like a creature. It seems we need a simulated combat to figure out Simul what happened in your body. Please hold your terminal tight and stay still. Okay, what's this gonna have? What's this gonna do now? Getting more mysterious. Oh, what? Simulated, simulated training ground. Training. Don't worry, Yang Yang and I will assist you. Please fight the simulated tacit discords like you normally would. Wait, we have Paisa with us? I don't even know... Okay... Trial, I see. Because this is in a uh, simulation training, okay. So... Ho! Right, yes, that creature. Oh, that's cool. Wait, does it follow? Yo, that's cool. Okay, wait, just use the yeah. And then you can use three characters at once. It's cool. Commence healing. Disperse. Run with the sounds. Different synchronization. Mm. As Yotan had previously detected, your bodily functions are in good condition, and you seem entirely unaffected by the Crownless's energy. We will temporarily boost your weapons ability for further testing. I'm testing on how to fight now, because last time it was so terrible I cannot even really dash and whatever. Oh yeah, how to lock in our right click again. I want to the sounds. The end has come. Let me be your blade. Let the winds roar. Not the slightest fluctuation in your frequency energy. Was not the resonance of the lady either. Hmm. Oh, so we'll do another round to fully test your potential. You see me switch? <laughs> How often I can switch with? It's so cool. Let me be your blade. Precipitant. Leave it there it shines. Swift and resolute. The hour is upon us. Oh, okay. That was fun there. Oh, dodge man, <laughs> dodge you. Lock, how do I lock again? Right click? I didn't. Swift and resolute. Let me be your blade. We have gathered all the data we need. The test is ending soon. That was so cool. Right? Well, then, you can this find is much better than ahead. yesterday. Now that I understand how to actually battle with proper controls. Wait, whoa. Well, what is this? Hello? Try to leave. The calm line is dead. Something's wrong. Hello? Gotta be cautious. Wait, I'm alone oh, now. What is this? The exit? Holy shit, what is this? It's glitching. The quest is glitching. <sighs> Can I leave? Leave. <sighs> I'm back to the same spot again. And this moon. What? What's happening? Are we going? Are we stuck in the loop? <laughs> are we stuck in the loop? Are those tacit discords? No, that is. That is like a boss. That looks like a boss. 
Or something, but I don't know how to say it. <laughs> okay, we explain. Can you give us some more details? Giant tacit discord in the side, enormous moon fading in both of them. An enormous moon looming above you. Now, this reminds me of the unusual sightings that supposedly oh, that happened was, during the past that was Holy. This is the first time we've run into anything like this since we put the training ground into use. The Sonoro Sphere captures everything that once happened in a specific time and place. Be it good or bad, we built this simulated training ground after the structure of Sonoro Spheres. Our goal was to extract pure remnant energy with the simulated Sonoro Sphere. But we cannot guarantee that all abnormal frequencies were eliminated. Your arrival may have revived the abnormal frequencies we accidentally captured. Huh? Remnant energy sometimes gives rise to memory manifestations of sentient beings. You may have encountered one such manifestation. I suspect it could have something to do with your unconscious mind. Such anomalies could have been hiding in the simulation. And they resonated with your subconscious. Or perhaps they were lifted from your subconscious in the first place. I'm afraid I can't give you a conclusion yet. Not until we've run a thorough analysis on the data collected. I'll also check the simulated sonorosphere again to see what on earth happened to it. In terms of bodily functions, you seem to be in perfect health. In fact, all the data look quite good. But if you feel anything unusual, please come find me anytime. Okay. Convene. Is this the wish? Resonate with various spell resonators. Yeah, I think that's the wish. So we finally unlocked it. Tap convene to get rid of Yeah, that's the wish 1 and 10. Okay. I, I have to press 1? Okay, sure. Is this a guarantee? I think this is a guarantee. I am Baija. We get Baija. The Academy. Let me witness where this encounter will take oh, us. Oh, so that means we get Baija. Well, kind of free, I guess. I think this is a guarantee thing. Oh, so we get Baija as well. Okay. So we do get her too. All right. <laughs> so let's see. Um, event wish. Oh, Gian. I guess it's Gian's weapon. This is targeted convene. So this is like select select a uh, a weapon, a guaranteed five star weapon. Okay. Well, now this. So this is the the beginner banner. Ancor, Jensen, Ling Yang. Wait. This is yellow. This is open. This is also blue. So wait. Okay, this is the permanent banner. This is the novice. So it's the same. Ancor, Jensen. <laughs> okay, so beginner is just discounted. And then. Once this is done, remaining fifty. Okay, so it's like guarantee. Uh, the the isn't the pity eighty? Is it? We can do fifty here. Okay, okay, I get it. So I can do the fifty right now. I have forty. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> okay. Wow. Good thing I got this uh, extra twenty today. We can just finish up this novice banner right now. Let's do it. First time wishing. 
Let's do it right now. First eight, first ten. What do we get? Connection error. Are you serious? Okay. Five star? No, four star, right? What plus a four? Three star weapon. Okay, that's the usual weapon. Uh, Jinzo. This is a four star weapon. Okay. Three star sword. Uh huh. Three star sword. Three star sword. Uh, gun. <laughs> gun. I forgot there's guns here. Where's our five star? Uh, I mean, four star. Is that it? Undying flame. Okay, got four star gun. We got four star whatever that was and a gun. Oh, time for another afternoon consultation, I see. Yo! What's okay. on your mind today? Wow, the character animation in the wish. Wow. Uh, I call it wish. Convene. <laughs> we got Tao Chi. Okay. Screen, screen this. First, uh, four star character. Tao Chi. Alright. Another is that a gun? Oh. Alright, this is my first ever ten pool. I'm screenshotting this. Okay. Nice, we got uh three four stars eh on the first ten. Two weapons and one character. Wow. That's actually Wow. <laughs> okay. Second temple. Five star. Nope. Four star. Any more four star characters? Oh. What does our loyal client wish to do? Yo. Okay. We got Alto. That's another four star. I don't really have any specific character that I want yet. Maybe a five star specific, yes. Uh. But I don't know all the four stars. <laughs> okay. Any more? Or maybe only one this time. It looks like it. All three stars now. <laughs> yeah, okay. Second, then put only one four star. Alright. It's okay, it's a new one. Third temple. If I start early, this. That would be insane. Nope. <laughs> Another four star character. Four star weapon. Okay, a Luna Carter. Oh, another one. Maintaining your health. Feel free to come by my gym. Yuan Wu, another four star. Let's go. Wow. Any more? Come on. Double. Well, we got a weapon just now. I don't think so. Yeah, okay, we got two four stars. Nice. Alright. Two more to go. Four star early. Come on. No. <laughs> I guess here, so maybe no luck. What is the PT? I heard it's 80 the highest, right? So what is hard PT? What does our loyal client wish to do? A copy of him. A copy of Alto. Alright. Uh, I don't know how you call it in here. Almost a constellation. Any, any new Forsta? Any new Forsta? Please? Ah, okay. So. Alright, we got a duplicate that's the first duplicate character 
and last one maybe this will be a 5 star come on maybe is it oh wait maybe it's guaranteed wait maybe it's guaranteed this one guaranteed yes okay so this is guaranteed who is the 5 star let's see where's the 5 star that's a 4 star weapon okay where is the 5 star <laughs> is it the last one Alright, oh, it's the last one then. Yeah, it's the last one. Okay, who is it? Which one of the three? Is it three? I don't know if there's only three or is it just them more? Five star. Oh wow. Okay. This flower is for you. Oh. I hope it makes you happy. Yo. Okay. Let's go. Okay, I remember Verena. I remember she's a good one. She's a good character. Like, I heard there's a five star selector thingy, whatever. I was thinking maybe out of I don't know who. Maybe I'll maybe I'll go for her. Well, I got her already. <laughs> now I don't know what other five star do I want. Okay, I got Verena. Let's go. Yes. Yes! <laughs> alright, alright, let's go, let's go. That's all in the the, the beginner convene, whatever you call it. First 50, eh? Okay! Yeah, th this is the selector, okay. Well, I was gonna select Verena, but we already got her. Jensen, Kalcharo, Verena, Ling Yang, and well, since I already have Verena, I don't know who I want to go for now. You can change the target anytime. So, okay, so cancel first because I don't know who do I want to select. Beginner's choice convene. Wait, what's the difference with this then? Oh, this one is the same, but you can select, right? It's still the same. 10. 10 convenes the first of the uh, yeah. So it's permanent. So it's the same thing, but you just have to select and it's guaranteed someone. Well, I don't know who to pick yet. Either I'm Angkor or Jensen, maybe? I guess. I don't know. We do not have any of the gold ones. Huh. Okay. How many days is this? 19 days. Okay. I'll wait for the second phase. <laughs> okay, so I got Pfizer. And also, not this Pfizer actually. Change this here. Okay. There we go. Talk is cheap. Show me the action. Okay, we got Parisha, but let's add everyone else as well. We have Verena. We I'm have. Ready. Let's select. No need to rush. Tauchi. Everything will work out in due time. I still have one in the. Oh, okay. We're in this together. And the guy is with you. I can help you. Then. Any detail along the way could become valuable intel. Will there be new discoveries? Alright, we got eight characters now. <laughs> and already got Verena, wow. So if that's the case. Wait, how do I put my profile? Change avatar. <laughs> wow. I heard Verena is good. And like, I was gonna pick her. But then I don't know who else I want. <laughs> Already got her. Well, let's go. Okay. Um. Oh 
yeah, we got a lot of the weapons, eh? I don't know what to, to, to use. <laughs> Hold on, let's, let's change a bit of weapons, maybe. I'm yeah, not even leveling up weapons or whatever. So we have Luna Cutter, sort of rage. I mean, I still want to use the rover. Oh yeah, we got a lot of these, eh? But I didn't equip. I'll I'll equip this later. Wait, we can auto equip it. Let's realize. Remove echoes from the slots. Wait, auto equip might remove echoes from the slots. Oh no no no. Oh wait, if I auto equip for random So just equip random echoes that have. <laughs> okay, that's interesting. Um, wait, wait, no, not echoes. Let's switch some weapons. Let's equip the four star stuff. <laughs> uh, three. Let's everyone equip something. What does uh, Marina use? Oh, okay, the same kind of. People are saying this character is like Nahida, <laughs> but older or something. I don't know. What is this weapon? Equip this. What's the name again? Tao Chi. This guy also uses a gun. Okay. New trophy, first try. Oh, we got more than just one character. Okay, I don't know how long more is the second part here, but because I did the wish, I feel like I want to stop here <laughs> and continue another day. This is already good enough. Eh? This is just like the second part. I'll just put my first uh, five star, I guess, my first wish. Oh man, wow. I can't believe I already have. Uh, you know what? I, I know I need visor here, but. Let's temporarily switch. Hopefully, we'll make new findings. One with the sounds. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> you know what? For for the story, I'll still use Yang Yang until the maybe we meet them. Okay. So alright, I think I'll stop for now here. I'll continue another video because I did not expect that the wish will be unlocked right here. In fact, this is. Uh, huh, okay. Yeah. So, my first <laughs> wish. Verina, Tauchi, Chisia, well, including a uh, Baiser, and Yuanu, and Alto. Alto, the. Can I, I? I forgot that I got a duplicate of Alto, right? Can I see this one, right? Ah, this is like the okay resonance chain. Activate. So what do I call this? C one, R one, <laughs> I guess. Okay. Right, yeah. That's it for this video, guys. Second part. <laughs> we did finally did wish. Uh, Res convene. Uh, I was, I, I'm used to calling it a wish, but yeah, okay, convene. <laughs> so yeah, that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.